What is good guys and girls of YouTube? It is your boy Justin Omoe and here I am with the part of the beat making thing where you uh, you know thing with the head. I'm gonna be making the melody from my head into the computer and I'll show you exactly what you know you have to do to do you know get that out of your head. I'm using the piano v2 by the way from Arturia just for now. You can use any sound to be honest as long as you understand its pitch. So yes, first of all, piano roll. I'll just minimize that real quick. Put this to one fourth of a beat snap because that's usually the sublime thing to choose. All right. I have a melody in my head right now and I don't know. I'll just, if I forget any, I'll just make some notes in my head. Um. All right, so we got that type of thing in our head, right? First off, I want to change the tempo, right click the tempo, tap, and do it to the humming. So it's around 108, all right? And I'm going to record this sound here, the same humming just in case I forget or if I, you know, make up some interesting notes along the way. So let's see. I'll just do a real quick recording. <laughs> That's obviously a lot of notes, but I'll get to the first few ones for y'all or so and show you what's in my mind. So first of all, we need to get that first note down. Hmm. <clears throat> What tone is that? Well, if you've been watching my um, interval video that I did the other day, you'll probably be able to understand the sense afterwards. But for this, hmm, we have to find that note. If you are well known with the keyboard, you would know that C is the ah, ah, hmm, ah, hmm, hmm, ah, 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 it's a little bit before a C note, so that's a C right there. We want ha. So that note right here, if I make this bigger for y'all. B. Ha ha. Here's the interval. All right. Ha ha. Mm -mm. If you see my video from yesterday or Monday, whatever the intervals, you would understand. Ha ha ha. That little interval with that NBC sound. That sound. That is the interval. Ha ha. Mm. So it's like a sixth up. Mm, mm. If you still have no idea what I'm talking about, I highly recommend watching that video. So we are going up a major sixth. So a sixth up from B is, let's see, B. By the way, it's a B major. Just the melody of the sound is a happy melody. So it's a major tone. Mm. So if you know your scales about music theory, this is why it's all essential. It's uh, basically B, C sharp, D sharp, E, F sharp, G sharp, A sharp, B. So it has five sharps. Good. B, C, D, E, F, G. All right. So G sharp. And if you play that. Da 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 It's not that ah uh, ah uh, ah uh, which is the ah uh, 
ha 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 So you can see it went down. We went two notes down, a uh, I guess you could say a major second down. And then the ha 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 it's basically going back to this note. So this is what we have so far. Oops. Na 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 na. I'm gonna go up an octave on my keyboard and let's see. Uh, mm, 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 uh, uh, mm, mm, uh, mm. Nope, that's not it. Mm, 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 uh, so, mm, mm. if you know the interval, that song "Go to Sleep." <clears throat> or that Mr. Clean It's a minor third up That's a major second So you can hear it goes like up in the extended scale If I go But we're not gonna We're gonna So That's a minor third And think about this alright um, if you are confused, think of the first note. Uh, 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 and if you had enough practice, you could hear that's an octave. Go to sleep. So hopefully you can make these connections in your head about the pitch, the tone of the pitch, and the relationship between them. Because if you understand these intervals, you will be better in terms of understanding what note is next in my head. What do I do? How do I go about it? <clears throat> so going back here. So if you could remember the relationships of those sounds, ha, huh? uh, did I go back here or did I go? I think I went down. I mean, let me play this back. Yeah, I go, I will go down. My bad. So it's um go up an octave. So it's basically. So could you understand or hear that? Another tip, I don't know if I talked about it with the intervals, is go do the ascending as well as the descending, aka do the downwards. Mm -mm, mm -mm. If you think of it again, it's another major second. Mm -mm, mm -mm. So yeah, there you go. So here we got. Hmm. Oh. Hmm. I need uh, uh, um, mm, mm, mm. so what, what key am I? It doesn't sound like it's a, um, what you call it? It's not like a major. So I'm thinking it's a minor second. Let's see if it sounds right. For minor second, you could think of it as the Jaws song. Let me see if I got that. So you know that that that's the 
the relationship with that little interval there. In this case, it was E to D sharp. So let's go back. Is wait, what is this one? So mm, mm, <coughs> my bad. For this interval, if you think of the uh, "Here Comes the Bride," uh, 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 mm, mm, mm. so it's a fourth down. So B, C, D, E. So we're going back to the tonic note. Oh, wrong one. <laughs> there you go. Dun, 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 mm, mm. Um, the reason why it sounds weird is because distance is supposed to be like. Dun, 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 dun. So uh, put that back there. Dun, 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 dun. Let, me, let me see if this works out. I think I start here. Uh, maybe extend it to the next measure. All right, yeah, 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 that's right. So if I put on a metronome real quick, I'll lower it down for y'all. And I'll hit Control L. Which is the same little phrase here, uh, phrase, phrase, um, right here. Dun, 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 one, two, three, dun, 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 dun. So, hey, oops. Dun, 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 three, dun, oh, dun. Oh, my bad. I meant to put an E as well. Dun, dun, dun. I think I'd repeat it twice in my little uh, Edison clip here. Yeah, I did. All right. Do do. Ha 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 do do so let's see you around I like that sound too dun 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 Yeah forget what I sung there do do dun dun I'm trying to get lower in my humming. Doom doom do do do. So think of those three notes right there, real quick. Do 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 do. All right. Now we could probably envision it. Do. Do, do, do. Oh, let me play on time as well. Do, do, two, three, do, do, do. So it's going to be half or quarter notes. There you go. Do, 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 two, three, four. All right, so do, do. So that's a G sharp. Oops. Doesn't that sound like a godly little inversion? Or inversion. Oh, shit. What's the word? Interval. <laughs> so that's the fourth. Alright, 
So basically what we did here was translate what was in our mind using the inversions. 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 What's the word? Interval. And understanding the root, uh, the first note. Uh -hmm. I based it off the C, of course, because that's a note that we all know dear and well. It is also possible to know what note is what, like if I press any key on the keyboard and I'm like, oh, what key is this? Is it a G, uh, G sharp or whatever? No, it's F sharp. There is ways to understand the tones as well. And I had it on that website that I showed y'all in the video before. There was like identifying notes and stuff like that. The more you train your ears to understand these pitches, as well as the intervals like I just showed you, you are able to translate those melodies into, you know, what I did here, the computer. But anyways, that's basically how you are able to translate melodies in your head into the computer. If you got any questions, be sure to ask in the comment section below. I always answer questions as well as uh, if you are new or something. So yeah, thank you guys and girls for listening and watching. My name is Justin Omoe. I hope this video helps. And with that being said, peace. I'm out.